my name is Justin Staub, and I am your DECA GOAT. Today, let's talk about explaining DECA to people who know nothing about DECA. The presentation that I'm showing you below, even in its bare bones format, is linked down below as a Google Slides. You can use it and share it however you need to for your club. When I interact with individuals for the first time that don't know anything about DECA, I find it very difficult to explain. Because you've got the different things that you can say that DECA is. DECA prepares emerging leaders, or it's all of these things. It's really difficult. So I try to think about my message for three main groups. The first group is students, and I try to tailor my message specifically to students. The second group is educators. I try to tailor my message to them. And the third group is business people, and I try to tailor my message to the community or to the business in, in specific ways. But all of those messages start the same basic way. The same basic way is really DECA is a student club that challenges students to provide specific knowledge in one of 50 different business-related fields through real-world application. Now, key tip there is I have that memorized. Um, I usually stop my explanation at that point, and I see I try to gauge body language if they're really interested. If they're really interested, sometimes the individual will ask a follow-up question, and sometimes I will jump into the tier two or the, the next level of explanation. Tier two really is really how it gets specific to students or to uh, educators or to business people. So let's talk about students. For students, I usually say that DECA provides the opportunity for you to follow an interest in any of these specific areas and fields that you can't learn about in school and that you get to show everybody how much that you know and that you get to prove that on a stage at the district, at the state, and at the national level. And you can win scholarships because of it money and showing how much you know are really key to students. For educators, it's entirely different. I start with a basic pitch, but then I go into the fact that DECA really allows authentic assessment for students in any of these 50 different marketing or business or entrepreneurship related fields. And yes, I know there's more career clusters than that, but it gets overwhelming to list them all. So I usually stop at that. And I say that DECA is an opportunity to learn beyond the curriculum, to take what they've known in the classroom and apply it to something specific and to see the real world feedback of business people replying back to them about how how you have done in your specific competitions. It usually gets the educators in the crowd, especially principals and school board members. When I talk to the business community, I explain that in school systems, we have very rigid curriculums and DECA provides an opportunity for students to take that rigid curriculum and things that they can't learn in their schools and apply it to all of the many different things that they're interested in. And DECA helps students build that confidence and those soft skills that you want to see in your uh, first interviews with students. And it allows them to practice thinking on the spot and being very thorough with their explanations of real world problems. And that usually applies to, or appeals to businesses pretty well. So again, I recommend three basic pitches. They all start the same way. And then you always pause and you always kind of see what your audience wants. And then I dive into either what is it for the students, what is it for the educators, or what is it for the business persons. I hope this helps. And my name is Justin Stalm. This is just the beginning of your DECA success journey.